Hey Jishwa, well, welcome back to another episode of Is It Worth It? So for today's episode, we got this cool product right here. If you guys can see in my hand, pretty much what it is is the iPhone 11 Pro case. So first thing first, let me actually unbox it to show you what it looks like first. So when you first open the packaging, very similar to like the other one, you guys can see the packaging is like that. So this one is pretty much the same as the other one that I showed you guys last time, but I think there's a little bit of a slight difference on the side of the case itself. So like this pattern right here is a little bit different, but everything else is pretty much the same. Where it has like a built-in uh, screen protector right here. And then basically how you guys just remove it is just putting your hands through like the gap right here and then just remove it out like that. And then what they provide inside this little case is some like wipes and stuff so you can wipe down your phone before applying it on and whatnot because you guys don't want any dust or anything on your screen. So that way you guys can get the full range of the touch control and everything else. So first thing first, I'm just gonna apply this on to show you guys what it looks like and how you guys apply it on. So all you have to do is put the phone onto the front case like this. Make sure it's in like that first. And then you guys wanna apply this layer on afterward. So just make sure you push all four corners. Make sure it goes all the way in. Make sure all these are all filled up as well, so there's no gap all around the case. So I'm just gonna touch the screen really fast to show you guys when I actually can sense the finger being touched on the screen or not. All right, so it does work. Let me close it and touch it one more time. So it does work. So when you guys first get this, you wanna make sure you remove the sticker so you guys can actually use the uh, full range of this case. So that's basically the case itself. All the buttons are actually really easy to use and whatnot. Uh, the bottom part, you guys can see there's a big enough gap or a hole area where you can actually plug in the cable to charge it right there. Doesn't block the speaker at all. Audio comes out really nice right there. You guys still get to show like what kind of phone you guys have in the back to kind of show off if you guys want that functionality. But like how I mentioned in all my old videos, I personally don't like showing off my case too much because I don't want people to steal it. So that's basically everything about this case. Um, let's talk about the overall case itself, how well built it is. They say that this case is shockproof and scratch resistant and it's actually really heavy duty. And I believe that because if you guys look at the whole build quality of this case itself. It has like the corner shock proof on each corner as you can see right here. So that, that way when it drops, it kind of protects the case and whatnot. So that's basically everything that's on the case. Now that we talked about the case and show you guys how to apply it on and everything that's on this case, now to answer the question of whether or not it's actually worth it or not. Um, this case in particular costs around $14 and for that price range would I say that's actually worth it or not Obviously, I'm gonna say that this product is worth it in general If any case in general is actually really worth it because you guys don't want to damage your phone Especially if you guys pay like over thousand dollars for a phone You guys want to protect that at all costs So you guys don't have to go back to like the Apple store or any other uh, repair store to kind of fix it But then for those of you guys who don't have a phone or don't have any use for this And obviously don't buy it because you guys don't need it and you guys don't want it but other than that, that's much it for the little unboxing, testing, and feedback about this product. Hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you guys did, then make sure to subscribe, like, and comment down below. And if you guys like this video and you guys want to see more, then make sure to click on the bell notification on the bottom so you guys can be notified of new videos that will be coming out soon in the future. But as always, make sure to stay positive, be you, and I'll see you guys in the next episode of Is It Worth It? Peace. And then for today's G-Squad fan shout out day, we have...